your hand. What the hell happened here? Looks like these men were still breathing pretty recently. This doesn't bode well for Katsura. We need to find him now. Right. I'll start over there. So much of the town has been burned down. So many homes. We're meant to be fighting for a better country. But this is anything but. What were we talking about again? Found you at last. Say your prayers! One man against those samurai. For your kindness. That takes care of that. Now then. Let's ask our friend here what that was about. Thank the stars. Glad it was you too who showed up. Katsura, I had a feeling that was you. What are you doing in that getter? The Chosu men feared the worst. I've been looking into the Shogunate's next moves, but I've let down my comrades by not being able to fight with them. Genzui especially. It wasn't for nothing, though. I got my hands on some vital information. The Shogunate are going to send in a force to deal with Choshu soon. The Shogunate is making a move. Hmm. They're seizing their chance to take the Choshu out once and for all. Indeed. And they're expecting the Satsuma to provide the best part of the force. Them again? But weren't they planning to revolt against the government? Well, the Satsuma are making a show of compliance to the Shogunate, 
which will spell the end of the Choshu. Any bright ideas? Hmm. You know, I've always wondered why the Choshu and Satsuma don't just make an alliance. You're the only ones with enough power to bring about change in this country. If you joined forces, you'd be unstoppable. You're not wrong. It would be incredible. Could it be done? But the Satsuma and Choshu are sworn enemies. We cannot simply form an alliance. That's right. Focus on the past and you lose sight of the future. To make a real change, you're going to have to make some hard choices. <sighs> I see what you're saying. Then we should ride to Kyomizadera Temple. Takamori Saigo of the Satsuma should be there at present, as far as I'm aware. He's the commander of the Satsuma forces right now. If we can persuade him, this plan might have legs. Let's meet at Hyomizudera Temple! <sighs> I've procured some fine wares. Please, have a look around. Thank you very much. Is there anything else? What will it be? Is there anything else? With pleasure. Please, come again. What do you need? An excellent choice. Sure.
What do you need? Anything else? Could I leave it to you too to broach the subject? I doubt he'll be in the mood to listen if an enemy like me shows up out of nowhere. No problem. We'll handle this. So, Saigo's in this temple, right? Ah, oh, that's right. The former chief priest of this place, Gesho, was said to be close with Saigo, and I hear today is the anniversary of his death. I was told by a geisha who was climbed from Satsuma. Apparently, he met his end during the Ansai Purge, where he and Saiga were persecuted. <sighs> it won't be easy. But as long as you're sincere, and make him understand that it's all in the best interest of the country, he'll come around. Mm, okay. Time to head inside. We'll get kicked out if we just rush in. Better to wait for the right moment. The grounds are pretty big, so we should prioritize locating Saigo. I'm ready for action! Is at the Jojuin Temple. Yeah. <laughs> 
In order to lead the expedition against Choshu, what do you intend to do, Zaka? That's what Gersho advised, I wonder. Well, I'll leave you to ponder it. Some solitude may bring you clarity. Just want to talk, not fight.
crossing blades with someone with no intention to kill is pointless. You said you would like to speak to me. Hmm. Satsuma never chose to begin this fight. That decision was the Shogunate's. Forget the Shogunate. I want to speak to you, not them. It was the Choshu who drew their swords first. And considering their behavior in Kyoto, how can we leave them be? Look, I understand Satsuma's perspective, mm. but... Have you thought about our future? What do you mean? Hmm. Change this country? You, what are you saying? Saigo, deep down, I know you agree with me. There are things Satsuma can only accomplish with Choshu by its side. You want us to march alongside our sworn enemies? I simply cannot see it. And yet it can be so. If we should will it. But first, I should apologize. I am sorry. I could not stop the conflict earlier. <gasps> Katsura of the Choshu? What are you wearing? Oh, ignore these filthy rags. I assure you, my aspirations remain unsullied. As my associates have said, we must put aside our differences. Even if it means moving heaven and earth, we must transform Japan. Katsura, I... I hear you. I accept your proposal. Hmm. <laughs> Yesho, too, would have been glad to put an end to the bloodshed. Then it's settled. The Choshu and Sasuma who joined forces, and we shall be the ones to see it through. You know, I've heard that in the West you're meant to hold hands and shake them on occasions like this. Go on. Try it. Saigo, I look forward to working with you. The pleasure is mine. Takamori Saigo, swayed by Ryoma, defies the Shogun's orders and calls off the Satsuma assault on the Choshu. This episode helps the Satsuma and Choshu draw closer, and they conclude an alliance aimed at overthrowing the Shogunate. Don't you remember what I told you back then? That I had a dream as big as the damn ocean. <laughs> this way. Take your feet! 
They don't give off easily. Okay, plan. Ah, this is a real mess. <laughs> uh. <laughs> After being attacked at the Terada Inn, Ryoma Sakamoto took refuge amongst the Satsuma clan. Might not be so lucky next time. I'm going to have to leave things to you for now. I'm counting on you. Did the Ryoma make it away without any trouble? Sorry I couldn't be there for the send-off. Now we can't afford to ignore what happened at the Tarada Inn. But we still don't know the true course of events. Kondo and Hitikata were away from Kyoto, serving the Shogunate which puts both of them out of the picture as suspects. If the Satsuma Choshu Alliance searches for the culprit in the open, we'll only incur the wrath of the Shogunate. And that's where you come in. We want you to infiltrate the Shinsengumi and sniff out the culprit from within. I leave the matter to Katsura's judgment. I knew you'd be on board with the idea. You can handle yourself and adapt to the unexpected. Well, perhaps some of them already know of you, but with a little disguise, no one will notice, I'm sure. You can learn from me. Come to Nishi Honganji Temple once you're fully prepared. You need to be ready to pass the initiation. I'm afraid that we will have to confiscate them!
What about? Oh, this is really lovely. What is it? The, the hat came out of nowhere. Well, you can thank my father for them. And for all the abuse heaped upon me because of them. But for them to be called beautiful. <laughs> Maybe they're not so bad after all.
Give me more. More. I thank you. And in return... This place is being used as a Shinsengumi outpost. The arrangements for enlisting have already been made. Thanks to a Satsuma connection, they're expecting a skilled Ronin to join their ranks. You've got a Shinsengumi uniform already, haven't you? You should change into it now. Unless you can uncover who orchestrated the attack on the Tereda Inn, it won't be safe for Ryoma to come back. I know you're up to the task. The stakes are high. But I'm counting on you. Huh. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Saigo and I will be praying for your good fortune. Ah. You must be the new recruit. I've heard much about you. I've heard talk of your skill with the sword. But a lot of the men here like to talk big. So I'll have to see it to believe it. Hmm? Have I seen you someplace? Now there's a fearsome look. Now I expect great things from you. Though I swear I know you from somewhere. Ah, maybe I am. My mistake, I'm sure. Ah, I haven't introduced myself, Shimpachi Nagakura. And this cold fish is Hajima Saito. Saito, show the new recruit around our outpost. And make sure you put them through their paces. Make sure you listen to Saito's every word, you hear? His skill is peerless. <laughs> Don't upset him or you're done for. <laughs> Good grief. Not a chance. Nagakura's superior to me, no question. He's just testing my patience, as usual. The training facilities are just over there. Let's head in. You won't make it into the Shinsengumi without some skill at the sword. It's time to show me what you're worth. Try taking him on. Good, I have high hopes. Oh, I dismiss! to see a little more. Now, I'd like you to face him. Don't disappoint me.
Now. What's the verdict? Think they've got what it takes? The technique is certainly interesting. Not bad at all. Well, coming from you, I'll take that as a high compliment. Now, what say I grant them the honor of a bout with their superior? Nagakura is in a different league from the other members you fought. Fancy your chances? Ha <laughs> ha! Don't you worry. No one's going to die. No need to hold back, newcomer. Throw everything at me! Nagakura is no mean feat. Right then, follow me. Ah, you must be the newcomer. Could you come here a moment? Sorry for interrupting, but even in this state, I thought I should at least introduce myself. This is Soji Okida. Neither I nor Nagakura are his match in swordplay. That's all in the past now. Now that I'm bedridden, I don't amount to anything but dead weight. If you want to improve, Saito could teach a thing or two, I'm sure. He's peerless, after all. <laughs> Okita, I'll go on to the dojo. Send the new recruit over once you finish talking. So then, why do you want to join the Shinsengumi? <laughs> well, I can't disagree with that. Put your life on the line. And Kondo is sure to reward you generously. Saito's waiting, isn't he? You should get going. I'll see you later. 